Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Andrea and today I'm setting up my bullet journal for June. My theme this month is succulents and it doesn't even involve any drawing. I'm starting with my quote page, writing out, you are stronger than you think. I'm decorating all my pages this month with these really cute succulent stickers that were sent to me a couple of years ago by Paper House. If you want to see another version of a plant-themed bullet journal, I created one in March 2020 where I drew all of the plants and it turned out really cute, so I'll leave a link to that below. On the cover page, I'm writing June 2022 and adding more stickers. The next spread is my two-page monthly calendar layout. The next page is my mood tracker. I'm tracing an empty sour cream container to create a circle in the middle of the page. I'm using a pencil sharpener to create a smaller circle in the center of the first circle. Then I'm splitting this up into 30 sections for each day of the month and adding a key at the bottom of the page. I'll fill in the colors for the mood tracker key later on. I just hadn't decided which colors yet at this point. The next spread is my highlights of the day page and my habit tracker. For the highlights of the day section, I'm writing 1 through 10, 11 through 20, and 21 through 30 in three columns. This month, I'm tracking three habits. I'm drawing three rectangles off-centered from each other for each of the habits. Above each rectangle, I'm using a Crayola Super Tip marker to highlight each section. And in these highlighted sections, I'm writing the title for each of the habits. Now I'm coloring in my mood tracker key with shades of green and yellow. Now that I've finished creating all my pages for the month, I'm going back and adding more stickers to some of the previous pages. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I love how all these pages turned out and they were so quick and so easy to make. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more bullet journaling videos and I'll see you next time.